JR talks about the atmosphere to play at Duke and how it is not comparable to any experience he has had before. It is one to remember. Uh, definitely uh, one of my dreams growing up. Um, growing up, I always wanted to be a Dukie, but uh, unfortunately, um, I wasn't able to get recruited by them. But uh, it was it was probably the greatest greatest uh, opportunity to have just to play against those guys, and especially um, at the time, I think they were number one. So. It was pretty cool. JR has worked very hard to achieve all of the accomplishments throughout his four years at the school. To be honest, like I wasn't even thinking about it, um, but it was definitely it's a great accomplishment. Um, it, it's crazy because for me uh, in high school, I didn't get to score my thousand. So um, being able to score that at this level, uh, it, it shows uh, like hard work kind of pays off and you just got to keep on going. JR looks up to AI and he admires his play and uses it in his own. One guy I would say is uh, Allen Iverson, um, kind of smart guy, uh, really has that, that killer mode, uh, just wants to kill everybody out there. Um, and uh, growing up, uh, I've watched him and, and kind of try to simulate some things, um, but he's, he's definitely one of those guys that you just kind of look up to. The team hopes to win an American East Championship and clinch a berth to March Madness. The ultimate goal is to, to win a, a conference championship, um, but it's one game at a time. Uh, we're four and three right now in conference. So it's just uh, winning the next game and, and then you move forward and you take the next step forward. With JR's senior year coming to a close, him and the Hawks hope to make a push for an AE championship and to clinch a berth in March Madness with a very senior-heavy team. With STN2 Sports, I'm Derek Bennett.